A nationwide formula shortage has parents scrambling to find food for their babies. A review of supplies at 11,000 stores nationwide shows nearly 30% of popular baby formula brands may be sold out. In Minneapolis, stores are reporting out of stock rates for certain formulas at above 50%. Kate Raddatz shares what's causing the shortage and what parents can do. Empty shelves for baby formula at this Target in Chaska are a common sight at stores across the country. It's become impossible. Kelly Baker was visiting multiple stores trying to find the formula brand her infant daughter Sophia was used to. Just recently, she decided to switch brands because it was what she could find in stock online. It's just been a struggle and it, it makes you nervous as a parent. That you won't be able to find it. Stores like Costco and Walgreens are limiting the number of formula products that customers can buy at one time. Supply chain issues related to COVID are one contributing factor. Then in February, there was a recall on select lots of Similac and other formulas made in Sturgis, Michigan. We've had a, a double whammy. Hennepin Healthcare Pediatrician Dr. Krishnan Subramanian says parents who are struggling to find formula can try buying online or try looking in smaller stores and drug stores. He tells parents to never water down formula, make homemade formula, or switch to whole milk early. We have seen kids get hospitalized for these concerns, and, and this is what we're trying to avoid. Dr. Subramanian encourages concerned parents to reach out to their pediatrician. He anticipates the shortage could improve as production ramps up again in the coming weeks. Kate Raddatz, WCCO4 News. The American Academy of Pediatrics is advising parents to buy no more than a two-week supply of formula right now to help ease the shortage. The Academy says for most healthy babies, it's fine to switch to any brand formula that you can find.